Hi guys, welcome back to another episode of Star Wars Jedi Fallen Order. Um, so we Very are... Very good, Padawan. You've cleared the way. What are you talking about? <laughs> I needed this tomb raised. And now that I have what I need, you're of no use to me. Can you reverse what she's done? <laughs> Thanks. Hope this new encryption keeps her out for good. Okay, can I just say that jumping and force pulling the rope towards you is one of the coolest things I've done in a game. Uh, that's so cool. Probe droid processing unit. What's it like hacking other droids anyway? Ooh. Yeah, I feel weird about hacking people too. For a good cause though, right? Ooh, so we can now hack droids. Oh, that's cool. Um, yeah, so we've raised the... Uh, Check in with the Mantis. Drilla probably knows where they are. You sure the comm's fixed? They're not answering. Something's wrong. We need to get back. New objective added to the hollow map. Okay. Where is it? Get back to the Mantis. Um... Yeah, we we around. been in the tomb of some kind of trap. Seems like we've been walking into a lot of them lately. Wait, do you hear that? And um, we've done the tomb of Mictral. Um, and now we're obviously on our way back to the Mantis. Is this even the way I've got to go? Yeah. Have you seen my rations anywhere? No, but the smell attracts guys. You didn't leave them open. Plastic brats, I only walked away for a second. Have we been that way? Yeah, it's not saying I haven't been there before, so... Um, so, as of the time of recording this, I've just finished watching uh, Rogue One and uh, A New Hope back to back. Um, so, that was quite cool. Um, I edited them together, so I got rid of the end credits of Rogue One and the um, opening scroll of uh, A New Hope. Which kind of made me feel a bit criminal, if I'm honest, um, removing that uh, opening crawl. But I wanted to see that transition. Um, so I've, yeah, I've just spent about four hours watching them back to back. And it was four hours very well spent. Uh, I've forgotten how much I love uh, Rogue One. And uh, I'd forgotten... Well, I haven't forgotten. I reaffirm how much I, I uh, love a new we'll hope. Uh, yeah, how much I love a new hope. Uh, it's definitely uh, my favourite Star Wars film out of all of them. Um, there's probably a quick way back to the Mantis, but retracing our steps seems like a good thing. Um, Okay, this is, uh, this is going to be tight. I kind of want to get back to the Mantis, 
before I uh, rest. I love doing that. Uh, right, I think that was a that was a way back. Wasn't it? Oh man, okay. Maybe I should have just rested. <laughs> Dealt with those stormtroopers again one when I had uh, had some health. Never get sold. There we go. That was stupid. I can't believe I got killed by a, one of those last time. Oh no, oh, I messed that up. I think this is the quickest way back. <laughs> it brings us up here. Something. Oh, maybe I wasn't supposed to win that. BD, where are we? BD one. Hello, buddy. Where are you? BD? We've got to find a way out of here. Okay. Wherever here it is. In another ploy to kill uh, Cal, Trilla lured him onto, hanging, onto a hanging sarcophagus and instructed her forces to shoot it down. In that moment, Cal regained the ability uh, to pull his lightsaber and narrowly escaped. On their way out of the tomb, Cal and BD found another encrypted log from Cordova explaining the key to the Bagano vault is a device called the Zepho Astrium. To access the vault, they'll need to find one. Before he could return to his ship, Cal was captured by a bounty hunter who they work for remains a mystery. Okay. Uh... Whoever locked me up took my lightsaber. Gotta get it back. Something back there. My lightsaber is missing. Oh, I know that. Is that a power cable? Ah, there we go. 
That did it. Right, so how are we gonna how are we gonna fight with uh Here's cold. Stale. Might be deep underground. With no lightsaber. I just can't see. Right, so there's Philax in here. And that's a camera, because that's clearly following us. Right, there's Skaz. They're those horrible things off of Pagano. force push this because I kind of did that while the door was closed. Uh, there's a little gap. Let's see if I can find a way out of here. I wonder where we are. Are we Feels still like on... being watched? You are being watched. That thing above you is a, clearly a camera cow. Um, yeah, are we still on? Are we still on Zepho? Oh, not a wish off. Oh, hello. Hey, someone in there? Hi, Tuma the Nago. Where are we? Hopa, Sortomo Kili Uba, Shakpudu. He doesn't what? sound sort of tormo. Stuta carquina tonta. Tonta. Uh okay. I guess you're good. Hey, chuta. Sutum. What a weird man. We, and we can't. Yeah. Okay. That's not good. What are those? Oh, little things. Are those all dead? Oh, it's one of those Jostak things. If they're all dead or being fed into something. Okay. Not sure I like this. Right, we can't come in here without BD1, so really we need to find BD1. And there's only really one way we can go. Ah! BD? BD1? Is that you? I found you. Are you okay? Where is he? Let's get you out of there. Oh, 
Oh, those those monkey things from Kashyyyk. Oh. Ah, okay. I see. I see. We can go up. Here. Right, is there anything up here before I plug it in? No, nope, not by the looks of it. to see you too. Let's get that restraining bolt off of you. Jerks. Poor droids. Let's get out of here before the same happens to us. So, what droids have we got in here? Let's see how many I can remember. So it looks like we've got... Oh, hang on. No. Uh, captured along with Cal by the criminal syndicate, the Haxian Brood. BD-1 is separated and thrown into a droid prison cell. Known for mercilessly scrapping droid parts, the Brood's targeted him for dismantlement. Luckily, Cal finds him before the Brood can hurt him, and the two plot their escape together. So yeah, so we got a gonk droid. Uh, in the original Star Wars Battlefront and Battlefront 2, that was a medical droid, I think. Uh, that one there, that tall one in front of me. Um, we've got another astromech. Oh look, we've got a PT droid from uh, the prequel era. Uh, another one on the floor, dismantled, another gonk. Is that an interrogation droid? An Imperial interrogation droid? That's quite cool as it is. Go on, BD. So I'm kind of wondering whether this door will bring us back into that main you got room, this, or whether, um, yeah, okay, so that's a shortcut. Really great, BD. You hear that? Sounds like someone is home after all. So... Hey, I recognize this band. Yeah, this music, it's actually uh, a real band. Um, it's like a Mongolian band. It's, uh, yeah, they've... Um, I think they're called Who? H-U? Something like that. Um, yeah, really cool. But it's an actual band. Uh... Oh, wait, wait till we got two. Get out of here. We have a special challenger for you tonight. An enforcer from a bygone era. A Jedi! Let's see what he's got. Oh, somebody get baby his toy. <laughs> okay, well, is this a fighting I'll give you a show. Oh, hello. Oh, 
Come down and face me yourself. <laughs> I'm too busy counting my credits. <laughs> Talk to me. What's next? See, this is where. Look at the Jedi go. Oh, I've got the acid on those spider things. Get him some real action! Now that's what I call a fight! Let's level this thing! Hit him with something really nasty! Oh, no, 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 oh. Whoa, 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 whoa! BD! Yeah, this is uh, this is certainly hard. No, 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 you don't. Toss me one, BD. Right, my last stim. This is not your day. Oh no 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 that's not fair! Oh come on, I was pressing X to kill the Jotaz and then the spider got me. Ah. If I can get though one of those big things at the end. No, I won't. Okay, we're doing good so far. I haven't lost any health. No. No, that spider is out. No. Yeah. Yeah. 
no, 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 like, please be something like Storm Defeated. Frequently combines blast fire missiles and flamethrower and gauge recursion, relies heavily on jetpack, destroy jetpack. Hang on, is that the mantis? Quick, 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 That took a few tries, I'm not gonna lie. Hey Grease. You're famous down there. Yeah, they're an ugly group, huh? They smell like used droid oil. <laughs> At least they're okay. Yeah, a complication we could have avoided. Luckily, we found you. We have another complication. The Empire knows about the Holocron. That's not good. The entire mission is now at risk. I'm still out of breath. <laughs> and I had a nice chat with the second sister. Trilla. What did she tell you? She told me... She told me you betrayed her to the Empire. Is it true? She'll say anything to jeopardize this mission. Is it true? She was my apprentice. Before the purge. You should have told me. We're getting an encrypted message from Kashyyyk. <sighs> Mari. Cal, we found Tarful, and he is willing to meet you. That's not all. The Empire overran our position at the refinery. Saw retreated off-world. Some of us have joined the Wookiee fighters in the forest. Be careful. You too. Later. Later. We have our lead. Okay, this is fine. Everything is gonna be fine. I don't know what's going on between you and her. I mean, I figure it's some kind of Jedi thing, but I don't think this is the right time for it's it. It's not any of your business. I think it's my business. And we're all in this together, aren't we? Hey, Cal. I made a mistake, and I almost got you killed. Sorry. I mean, we all make mistakes, right? <laughs> well, maybe not you. <laughs> hey, why don't you cut her some slack? I'm not saying do it for me, but you two are the best thing that ever happened in my life. <laughs> Before you came along, all I cared about was a tight hand on a stiff eater. <laughs> That's a game turn. I know what it is. 
how life's not a game. Before you two, all I cared about was myself. Easy money. Now it's different. Right, so we had a few uh, data bank things, so uh, let's do these uh, really, really quickly. So, trapped by the infamous Sork Tormo, Cal and BD were forced to fight fearsome creatures. During the show, the Mantis burst into the Hax Haxion Brood's lair to rescue them. The reunion was an unhappy one, however. Cal learned the Brood found him because Grease lied about paying off his debts. Even worse, Cal was still reeling from his discovery that uh, Seer had given up Trilla under torture. Seer and Cal's argument was cut short by a transmission from Mary Kassan, uh, who had found Tarful in Kashyyyk Shadowlands. Okay, so that's that one. Uh, what do we know about Ordo Eris, the Haxian Brood? A shadowy crime syndicate that operates throughout the Outer Rim, led by the unscrupulous Sork Tormo. They control a network of gambling, slaving, and devious enterprises, particularly droid smuggling. Dealing in droid parts, their bounty hunters and mercenaries are known to use stolen, such stolen wares for personal cyber augmentation. An Ordo Eris, asteroid stronghold of the ruthless crime syndicate, the Haxian Brood. Located on the fringe of the Outer Rim, this shadowy starbase is chiselled into the remnant of a scattered planetoid decimated by ancient superweapons. A vile hive of lawless chaos in the fortress serves as a centre of the Syndicate's power structure, including smuggling, gambling, and its infamous Fight Club. Okay, and characters... Uh, unknown to his co-pilots, Grease hides a dangerous secret, a large gambling debt to the Haxian Brood. While tracking Grease, the Brood's ruthless bounty hunters discovered he's travelling with a Jedi, a much more valuable prize. They capture Cal and BD-1 for payback against Grease's debt. Grease and Seer rescue Cal, defeating the Brood and forcing Grease to come to terms with his addiction. Uh, yeah, because uh, he's got a... Um, Grease has got a bit of a gambling problem, uh, as we've learned through other dialogue as well. Uh, Sork Tomo, merciless and bombastic, Umbaran leader of the Haxian Brood. Tormo takes great pleasure in his fight club, an infamous arena where the galaxy wages on an open combat against bloodthirsty killers and Tormo's wild menagerie of vicious space beasts. Never shy on humour, he is a mercurial mobster with a penchant for violence and greed. Um, and we've done that one, and we've done that one. Right, um, let's just see if we've added any plants to, uh... Mm, that didn't take long. No, we haven't. But what have we got? So we've got cowpea, that's not really growing. Royal flowers, which none of these have grown uh, since we last looked. Um, right, I'm going to end the episode there. I uh, hope you guys have enjoyed it, and I will see you next time. Bye-bye.